community. But only men can play. Welcome and please subscribe if you are new to this channel. Drumming in Burundi is about history, said Oskan Shimiramana, the leader of the performers, the royal drummers of Burundi. It is about power. It is about freedom. Burundi's president at the time, Pierre Nkwa Onziza, signed a decree that banned women from performing the traditional synchronized drumming which is often accompanied by ritual dances, songs or poetry. Women are only allowed to perform the ritual dances. Also part of the new rules, drumming was mostly limited to official ceremonies. Private event organizers who wished to have traditional drummers perform were required to obtain authorization from a government minister and pay a fee for the privilege. Anyone accused of breaking the rules faced up to $500 in fines. In one of the world's poorest countries, where the GDP per capita was $239 in 2020, according to the World Bank. Six years later, the measures are still in place. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more.